The effects of jogging 20 minutes every day. Are you the one who is looking for an alternative of gym because you were unable to pay the gym fee or you are not able to find a free slot for yourself and go to the gym? Are you the one who want to put some efforts to make himself more confident, fit and handsome? Do you have fat in your body and you want to reduce it by using the easiest method? Are you afraid of dieting? Do you feel like if you start dieting, you will end up soon without gaining results? Then, no more worries. This video is just for people like you who do not want to start doing exercise or to do dieting and skipping their favorite meal. Hi, welcome to my YouTube channel. I hope you are doing well and living life to your fullest. If you are the person who wants to start jogging, then you are at the right place. Watch this video till the end and you will see different aspects of jogging. These aspects are going to cover some sections. For example, in this video, you will understand everything you need to know before jogging. What are the benefits of jogging? What are the benefits of jogging in morning and what are the things we need to consider for doing jogging in the evening? Moreover, in this video, we will look for the benefits of jogging every day. We will compare jogging and exercising. So let us begin without wasting any time. Body. Things you must do before starting jogging. Whatever you're going to do, you must do after knowing about it. The same rule applies to starting jogging. If you are going to start jogging, you must take special measures which are essential for getting those benefits. If we do not educate ourselves before starting any new thing, we may end up doing worse or may get hurt ourselves. Half knowledge is always dangerous, so tie this to your mind that you must get knowledge before jumping in something which is totally new to you. We are going to tell you what you need to do when you are just about to go after jogging. Watch this video till the end because it will be really beneficial for your health in the long run. So here is a pre-jog checklist. Eat, hydrate, stay safe, and warm up. Eat. If you are the person who is going to make a jogging routine, then you must take care of your eating routine. You can face so many problems while jogging because of your unhealthy eating routine. If you start jogging while it is supposed to be your mealtime, then soon you will be facing a hunger attack of your stomach, which will disturb your jogging phase. Moreover, if you eat just before going on your jogging track, it will cause a lot of discomfort. So, when should you eat for enjoying your jogging routine? Well, for this, you must follow a rule of your stomach. But if I say in general terms, then you should eat one hour before starting jogging. Okay, so what should be the specific nutrients of your food? To answer this question, I recommend you to go for your nutritionist. He can tell you the best for you. But if I say generally then, then you can eat a meal full of protein and carbohydrates, but in less fat. One hour eating before your jogging can also help your metabolism process. It will balance you with your hunger and you will not be disturbed by your stomach while running. There is another obvious benefit of eating before jogging, that is it will provide you with enough energy. You will feel more fresh and capable of maintaining your jogging. It will help you to achieve your jogging goals. So, if you are still watching this video, it means you do care about yourself and wants to know everything which is essential to get good output. You are watching this video, it means you have educated yourself about eating benefits and schedule for jogging. Hydrate. So, let us move towards the next thing, which is hydrate. Yes, hydrating is really not skippable if you are going for jogging. Let us say you are going to start off jogging, but after 5 to 10 minutes of sweating, you are faded. Oh no. Do you know this is the sign that you are providing harm to your body by jogging if you are faded? It is better not to do jogging if the result is going to be this much devastating. But here is good news for you, that you can continue your jogging without any disturbance if you can keep hydrating your body after regular intervals of time. Do not drink too much water as it can fill up your tummy enough that you can start feel heavy down there. And as a result, you may feel like you need to go for a bathroom for urination. It can also exert a lot of pressure in your bladder walls that after urination you may feel a lot of pain. It can also exert a lot of pressure in your bladder walls that after urination you may feel a lot of pain in your abdominal cavity. The best possible applicable strategy is to drink water before jogging. And if you sweat, you do not need to worry because you have already hydrated your body enough. Also, if you are going to do jogging for about 20 to 30 minutes, then you must keep your water bottle with you to drink water from it after every 5 to 6 minutes of running. Furthermore, if you do not get dehydrated, then it is possible that you may feel thirsty. So it is advisable to keep a water resource with yourself to avoid this phenomenon to occur. Stay safe and feel comfortable. Let me ask you a question. 
Why are you jogging? Of course, to feel more energetic and active in your life. But do you know all your activities affects your mental health and psychological behaviors as well? You must feel positivity and good vibes because of your jogging routine. If this is not happening, then you are really missing out something. Have a look at your checklist if jogging is not giving you what it should. Oh, so take care of yourself whenever you're going outside for doing exercise or jogging. One of the most important steps in this regard is to take your surgical mask with you on your mouth and nose to make sure that you are safe. As we all know that these days, a global pandemic has prevailed all around the world. COVID-19 has covered the whole world and it is still spreading so we must take care of ourselves for the safety of our whole family. Another thing to consider is to wear proper clothes according to the weather forecast. If you are living in a snowy area, then be prepared to face the freezing temperature. Wear warm clothes, but it must be comfortable. The clothes need to be warm and meet all the conditions required for a jogging suit. If you are living in a boiling temperature, then you must be prepared in such a way that you can cope up with that high degree temperature. You must be hydrated to avoid any kind of heat attacks. You must be prepared to defeat heat strokes. Moreover, you should wear clothes which guard your skin from sunburns. Always apply sunscreen to avoid sunburns, no matter what the temperature is. If you are living in a hot temperature holding area, wear sunglasses to protect your eyes from ray of high intensities. Always wear good jogging shoes to avoid discomfort. Also, choose a track which is situated near to your house. And this way, if any injury happens, even then you are safe because you are more likely to be rescued earlier. Another measure that you should take is to carry your cell phone with you. To call someone if you get stuck somewhere or get injured. You should always carry your identification card because you never know what the future is going to serve. So be prepared before leaving your house. Injuries are normal while performing any physical activity. So if you get out of your senses, which means you are fainted, any passerby will definitely come to help you and search for identification at first to know where you belong from. Warm up. If you want to maintain your energy level throughout your jogging interval, then you must start by doing warm up. Actually, warm up is a key to avoiding any injuries. If you warm up, you become familiar with the process and activity. Everything is just going to be smooth. You can say that warm up is just like a lubricant. Your body will be stretching up and you will become prepared to tackle with more speed. You will be more efficient. Organize your time in such a way that you find enough time for both warm up and jogging during your entire workout. Benefits of jogging on a daily basis. There's so many benefits of jogging. It can be said that if you are jogging, then you probably do not need any other exercise. Jogging has an entire package to strengthen your skin, brain, and body. So let us have a deep look into it and learn all of the benefits of jogging. Jogging benefits for weight loss. This is such an amazing feat of jogging that without mentioning it, every other thing looks absurd. So if you have fat in your body, then jogging can be highly helpful for you in losing all these fat. Just set a routine for it. Who wants to get obesity? Of course no one, but those who are suffering from abnormal weight gain and looking for a way to lose their weight, they must go for jogging. Because jogging is not a heavy job. You do not need to book a gym time. You do not need to spend any penny for getting high exercising machines. You can start jogging just today. Also, if you're not willing to do any kind of dieting, but commit to jog daily for 20 minutes, even then you can see a big difference. So, it is just a blessing for you since you do not need to sacrifice your hunger and lust for food. Jogging benefits the brain. Jogging is such a full-time work that it helps your body to remain fit in every desirable aspect. There is an old saying that a sound body has a sound mind. It means you can focus on your important tasks only when you are healthy. Health is wealth. When you jog, your blood circulation is improved and your brain gets enough blood supply to function properly. It will help your nervous system and its functionality. Jogging benefits for your skin. Jogging has so many benefits which are not ignorable, such as it has a high good impact on your skin. When you run or jog, it nourishes your body cells because of good blood flow through your entire body cells. While you jog, you remove so many toxins and waste salts through sweating. Thus, your skin starts glowing. You get such a vibrant skin due to daily jogging. Due to jogging, your body gets enough power to fight against cortisol hormone, which makes you look older. When your body acquires the power to fight against it, you automatically start looking younger. Benefits of jogging in the morning versus evening Waking up early in the morning to go for jogging makes you more disciplined. If you want to know the difference between morning and evening jogging, 
then what can I say is that both of them have their own benefits. While jogging early in the morning, you can see the sunrise while jogging. While jogging in the evening makes you capable of having the view of sunset. Both of them have their own set of benefits. Morning joggings can enrich your body with energy to start an exciting day. While jogging in the evening can boost your lung function, which will enable to jog you for long distances. Thank you so much for watching this video. If you like it, then do give it a thumbs up and subscribe to this channel to get notified whenever I post new content.